Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be testing another eyeshadow palette from the I Heart Revolution and Shrek makeup collection. I have tested a few eyeshadow palettes from the collection so far. I will leave all the testing video links below. The one for today's video is the Fairy Godmother eyeshadow palette. So it's a mini. It's actually called a Need a Hero mini eyeshadow palette. This retails for £6 and it's one of four in the mini Shrek and Revolution eyeshadow palette collections. It's in this beautiful crimson colour and then it's got the glitter from the fairy godmother's dress on as well and when you turn it on the back you've got prince charming there this does have eight shades in it has four shimmers and then four mattes as well inside you've got a little mirror and then the palette looks like this. I have to say, out of all the palettes that were on the collection, this definitely was my favourite mini of the lot. I think the blue and the pink and the white at the bottom are absolutely stunning. And I definitely don't have that crimson red colour in my collection, but I do now. I really like the fact that they've got the Fairy Godmother's Wand imprinted on the top mattes. And then, as I said, there's four mattes up here and then four shimmers down here. I think there are a lot of looks we could do with this palette. I am going to try and do a bluey look today. I've primed my eyes using the Revolution Ultimate Eye Base. Looking in this palette, there's a lot we can choose from here and I'm definitely wanting to use this blue and this white down here. I might try and see if we can get some of the red in as well. Pop the swatches in for you now. This is the I Heart Revolution I Need a Hero Eyeshadow Palette Mini. The pans look like this and the swatches look like this. I think this is an absolutely stunning eyeshadow palette. The colours are beautiful. I really love the colour story. I think it's very cohesive. I really like like this colour here. It's a blue shimmer but it's very icy and I think it's just going to look absolutely beautiful with the rest of the colours. I'm a really big fan of the pinks down here. I love this one in the middle here and then this red. I've definitely not got anything like that in my collection. I think this peachy one here will be good to blend the edges and clear up any messes that I make on my eyes. So I'm looking forward to having one like that in this palette. Let's give it a go. I'm going to take my angled brush and we're going to go in with a wing shade. I'm going to go in with the shade Teardrop which is this one up here. It's sort of a pink toned purple so I'm going to pop it on my wing. I feel like with this one I'm going to try and go for a cooler look but we'll see how it turns out. I'm going to just pop this on the wing area and then just bring it across the eyelid. I have had fun playing with the other Shrek eyeshadow palettes as well. I did get four from the collection. I will also leave my unboxing of my Shrek and Revolution haul below just so you can see what I've picked up because I have done a lot of testing videos with them. I'm really liking the colour we've got going on here. It's such a beautiful purpley pink colour. have got a little bit of fallout so I'm just going to dab it away with my clean brush. I'm going to do the same on the other side now. So I'm going to go in with the colour Teardrop again and then just pop it on the wing on my other eye. I think the colour payoff for this shade is really nice. It's such a pretty colour. And I definitely think these mini palettes are going to be really useful along with other palettes as well. So you can just dip in and out of the shades. That's what I've got so far. I'm just going to take it a little bit further over my eyelid over here and then I think we're done. I love that colour. Next I'm going to go in with this hero shade which is a darker pink here. It's slightly warmer as well. That's what the shade looks like there so I'm going to pop that on the inner corner now and blend it in. I know I did say I was going to go for a cooler look but I want to use some more of the mattes and see how pigmented they are. So I'm going to take that on the inner corner. Whoa. That's a really nice colour. I feel like those two have blended really well together. They just fit perfectly. So I'm going to do the same on the other side as well. And just drag it from the inner corner to the centre of my eyelid. I really like those colours. I think with the mini palettes, it's a lot easier to work out what you're going to do because the colour story is very coherent. Whereas with the bigger palettes, it's kind of all over the place, but I love it. <laughs> I'm actually going to go in with the shade Bubble, which is this bright red that's down here. Because I feel like this shimmer will go really well on the inner corner. I am going to pop some blue on, but we're going to move the place I was going to originally put it. So I'm going to pop this red here. Ooh, I'm finding these shimmers in the Shrek collection are absolutely brilliant. The colour payoff for the shimmers is really nice. I mean, that is a bold look. <laughs> I'm just going to take one of my thinner brushes now and I'm going to take the shade Hero again, which is this one here. And I'm just going to drag it up the eyelid on the outer corner just to get it in the crease. I'm going to do the same with the red shade that we used, Bubble, and just bring it up to the crease on the inner corner. 
Sometimes shimmers work extra well with a wet brush as well. But I'm thinking, looking at this, I'm very happy with the way that's looking, so I'm not gonna do anything with that. Shimmer-wise, we've got three that I haven't used, so I've only used this one so far. I'm wanting to put this one here, Tavern, on the outer corner a little bit. I feel like this one again, I'm gonna pop my finger in it just to get a bit of color payoff. I'm gonna pop that on the wing area. I like that. I really do like adding shimmers to the wing. I just think it makes it look so pretty. I really like that. It's very bold. <laughs> but what I'm going to do now is we're going to go in with some other colours. The shade Wand over here, which is this iridescent blue shade. I feel like that definitely is what the Elsa Princess palette is going to look like. I'm going to pop that on my eyelid now. I think I'm going to pop it in the centre and just see if we can get a little blue shimmer going across the pink and the darker pink. And just see if it ties it together. Ooh, that reminds me of Cinderella's slipper. It's a really nice colour. I'm going to go in it again and pop it on the other side. That's a very, very glowy shade. I really like it. As I said, I think a lot of these palettes can be used with other palettes as well. So if you want an inner corner highlight or just a shimmer like this, you can dip in and out of these palettes. I think they're great. That's the look I've got so far with the Fairy Godmother or I Need a Hero palette from the Shrek collection. I feel like a lot of people are gonna say the Fairy Godmother palette. <laughs> I'm gonna go in the shade Potion now, which is just this white shimmer here. It's coming off whitey silvery. So we're gonna pop it on the inner corner and see what it comes off like. I'm just gonna take it right on the inner corner and use use it to blend in with the blue that we've just popped on and then I'm going to do the same on this side as well. These shimmers are so pretty, I can't explain, like the light is catching them and they're absolutely beautiful. I'm going to take my waterline brush now and we're going to go under the waterline with a couple of the colours. I'm going to take the colour Teardrop which is this colour here and just take it from the outer wing and just drag it under my waterline doing the same on the other side I really like that. Just for the inner corner, I'm going to go back in the shade Potion, which is this white one down here, and then I'm going to pop that on the inner corner. That's really nice. I love that a lot of palettes now are having these highlight shades. I think it really helps you pull a look together. I feel like I want more of the blue on. I'm going to go pop some more of the wand shade just because I can't get enough to be quite honest. I just love how iridescent it is, it's so pretty. I'd be interested to know as well, did you pick anything up from the Shrek I Hot Revolution collection? I personally was really excited by it. I found that when I saw it advertised, I was just hooked on it. I thought it had a lot of nostalgia with it. I thought the collection was really put together well. And there was something for everybody because if you didn't want the big palettes, there were loads of little ones as well. And they did lipsticks, which were incredible. That is the look I've got so far with the I Hot Revolution and Shrek I Need a Hero Eyeshadow Palette Mini. I'm gonna pop some mascara on now. I'm gonna be using the Rem Beauty Mascara. And that is my finished look. I really love this eyeshadow palette. As soon as I saw it, I thought this is the one for me. It really stuck out to me. I think the crimson colour is beautiful. The glitter on the side is stunning. And when you open it up as well, you've got the most pretty colour story ever. I just, I love it. I think we have used most of the shades in here. There really is something for everybody. I think for a Christmas party, this will be beautiful. I'm very happy with the shade Potion and Wand. And I think this one down here was just so pretty. I definitely don't have anything like in my collection until this one and then this colour here I think this is a new favourite. I feel formula wise these are top of the range they're absolutely brilliant the blend was beautiful the colours are stunning just I've got nothing to say about it other than positivity because this little palette six pounds it's very portable it's got a lovely colour theme in there and even if you don't like these shades in the fairy godmother palette there were three other ones which you could choose from. I am just going to pop the Fiona transformation lipstick on this retailed for six pounds and I've been loving it so far is basically a pH changing lip balm. It looks like this in the packaging. It's a very neon Shrek green and it's absolutely stunning. When you pop it on your lips, it has a personalised pH pink. It's so pretty. 
And formula wise, I really like this. I think it's definitely something that you could wear daily. And it's just a lot of fun. I really adore this collection. That was me testing the mini fairy godmother eyeshadow palettes from the Shrek and I Heart Revolution collection. I really hope you enjoyed it. I have been testing a lot of other of the Shrek items from the collection and I've been loving it so much. They will all be linked below. Please subscribe if you like makeup videos because I am uploading daily at the moment. If you want to see more, you can follow me on Instagram. That's at Zoe Glitter, Zoe with a Y. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.